So, Mojang and Microsoft made a new launcher. The old one were perfectly fine, but they were ambitious, they made a new one. And, this game-breaking, quite literally, launcher is not a gateway to Minecraft, because, for some computers, mine at least, it's just blank screens on me. And, if you also experience this problem, this video is for you. It will hopefully help you be able to play Minecraft again. The problem is not actually that hard to solve. You've just got to go to this link here, which I will post in the description for real this time, unlike last time I said I would, and come here. And you see, already on Minecraft, download it again with a download link. Now don't click this. This is just a faulty launcher that doesn't work on your computer. So scroll down instead and come here where you see download for Windows 7 or 8. Now, this is the old launcher, so it will work. I believe you have to have a Windows to run this, and the Mac one is this one. I'm not sure if it works for Mac yet. I haven't downloaded it on my Mac. However, the Windows one for sure works where this one does not. So, click this, go through the downloading process, and then just uninstall the old one. You can do that by going to Files and clicking Delete. Then, make a shortcut how you had it before, like my Minecraft launcher here. Double click it and it will no longer gray screen. However, it will spam you with these every single time you open the launcher. Just click I understand. You can accept that if you want to, or you can just leave it. It does not matter. Then you click play. And that warning is just because I'm running off to find. You don't have to worry about it. It's not anything too serious. And after a lot of waiting, and here I am in my redstone world, the redstone guide. Look at all these stuff that you probably recognize, or maybe you don't because you haven't watched my videos, nobody has, lol. Um, I was experimenting with TNT and it stopped working, it started working again over there. So, wonderful, that's the next video. And um, I really hope that this worked for you. It worked for me, and if it doesn't work for you, honestly, I don't know. You've probably got some really unique problems, just buy a new computer at that point, it's not worth the trouble. Yes, it is. <laughs> Have a good day!